Donald Trump announced that he's planning to visit East Palestine after criticizing the Biden administration's response to the disaster. But did Trump do anything to make the railroads in this country safer? In recent years, railroad companies have targeted federal regulations as a way of reducing costs. Rail workers have blamed lack of oversight and regulation as one of the central causes of train derailments. The Trump administration was responsible for rolling back some of the key regulations that mandated minimum crew sizes and new electronic braking technology for trains carrying hazardous flammable liquids, much like the train that derailed in East Palestine. On top of this, one of the biggest individual donors to the 2024 Trump campaign is Timothy Mellon, former owner of Pan Am Systems, a massive rail company. Pan Am was bought by CSX, an even larger rail company, which donated almost $40,000 to get Trump re-elected in 2020. This isn't to say that the Biden administration is any better. It kept these deregulations in place and broke the rail workers' strike that sought to address these exact safety issues. But Trump's record, without a doubt, proves that he's no better.